Our next alumni fellow is Dr. Aaron Dunan from the College of Arts and Sciences. He lives in Oakland Park, Kansas, where he has worked in multiple roles as an interventional cardiologist. He is currently medical director at the Cardiac Catheterization Lab at Research Medical Center with HCA Midwest Health. After medical school, he did his residency at Cleveland Clinic Foundation and then fellowships at the University of Minnesota. Friend and former Alumni Association Foundation employee Bruce Steinbrock said, you have contributed to many things athletically over the years, including creating a scholarship that I know you are most proud to be one of the donors to the indoor athletic facility. Aaron, you are so deserving of this honor, and I know you feel a sense of pride to share this honor with your family and other fellows. Congratulations, we are proud to have you represent Washburn wherever you go. Dr. Newman is a, is a fellow and member of the Society of Cardi Cardiac Angiography and Interventions and of the American College of Cardiology. He has been published in several publications and volunteers with Under the Radar Foundation for Exceptional Careers. While at Washburn, he was an academic All-American on the football team and he earned a Burger King Scholar Athlete Award that he used to establish a scholarship at Washburn in his name. He remembers coming to Washburn uh, on an $800 scholarship and said, Washburn was where my entire medical career began. My professors were supportive but tough, laying the foundation for me to build on and in the remainder of my training. Washburn biology professor and chair John Mulligan said, his nickname, Cowboy, immediately made sense to me after watching him, watching him wrestle opponents to the ground. Aaron's last year at Washburn was my first year at Washburn, and he helped me set up my research laboratory in uh, Stoker. I recall how he took apart my new refrigerator and rewired it so the freezer would cycle between freeze, freeze and fall cycles. That refrigerator is still operational in my lab today. <laughs> so why are that just perfectly? Uh, former football teammate uh, Michael Edwards called his friend a great leader for Washburn Athletics and a great ambassador for Washburn University. Aaron, on behalf of the Alumni Association and the College of Arts and Sciences, we are pleased to honor you a Washburn Alumni Fellow. This is a large crowd, so I first want to say I'm honored to be here. There are presidents, there are CEOs, there are people that have dedicated their lives to education. And being part of that is uh, very humbling. So thanks to Dr. Farley and Dr. Stevenson, Dr. Mulligan, for help setting this up. Um, and thinking about what to say, there are many things that we could talk about. Um, you know, I'm fortunate to be the director of our ECMO program. I thought the best way to make you all feel as special as I feel now is to share a story with you. I had the opportunity to share this with some of the students yesterday. Uh, but I want to talk about a 38-year-old man that late last year uh, contracted COVID. And he caught that from his mother who works at our hospital. And he got very sick. So the husband also got sick, but he was in ICU for a couple of weeks. Son was not so fortunate. He spent about four months in our hospital. About 60 days ago, uh, those was on our ECMO machine. And eventually, we were able to watch him uh, walk out of the hospital on his own power. So, and to this day, he's been chilled probably both for the rest of my life uh, for being a part of that. Um, but the way that I think should make you all feel special is that I began my academic career here. And without the people in these walls and walking this canvas, uh, people like Dr. Farley guiding the whole ship, uh, you know, that gentleman may or may not be alive today. Uh, I took what I learned here and the opportunities that I had and took them to Cleveland and to Minneapolis. And, uh, and now I have a career where I can hopefully 
we save more lives uh, like that kind of man. And I owe it all to this institution because this is where it started. And, uh, and to that I say thank you to everybody. Um, to the students, you, know, you never know where you're going to end up. Um, a couple of pre med students sitting at my table today. Uh, you never know what you're going to do or how you're going to do it. Um, you know, in my case, I kept the blinders on and just kept plowing ahead, and that was just sort of my uh, way of doing things. But you'll find your way. Um, and, and I just say, keep doing it. Keep finding those experiences and, and plow ahead until you get to where you want to be. To the professors in the room, uh, a heartfelt thank you to everybody. Uh, and again, you never know who you're going to touch or how you're going to touch that person and make them into what they are. And so to everybody at Washburn, I say thank you and uh, I am humble and